Hey, my name is Scott from Bull City Homebrew, and today I'm going to show you how to use a wine thief. Now, just because it's called a wine thief doesn't mean that you can't use it for beer. It works just as well. One of the problems that homebrewers and winemakers have is that sometimes they need to take a hydrometer reading of their beer or wine while it's still in the carboy. Now, unless you have very long, skinny fingers, it's very difficult to get the hydrometer back out of the carboy once you drop it in. And that's where the wine thief comes in. This is a wine thief, and what it lets you do is we drop it into the carboy, we take a sample of the beer or wine, we can drop the hydrometer in the top, take a reading, and then we can put the beer or wine back in the carboy by just pushing on this little tip. It's really important that everything is sanitized before we take the hydrometer reading or use the wine thief. So I have a sink full of star sand here that I've got my hydrometer in, and I've got the wine thief in. We just want to make sure that star sand touches all the place where these things are going to come in contact with your beer or wine. Now here's a beer that I just moved over from the primary fermenter to the carboy and I forgot to take a hydrometer reading. So let me show you how we can use our wine thief to fix that. We'll take the wine thief, put it down into the carboy as far as it'll go, take out the beer sample, We'll drop the hydrometer in the top. And we can take our reading. Now once you've got the reading, just put the tip against the top of the carboy, and you can put all the beer back in. And we haven't lost anything.